Go back inside. We speak English, buddy. Look, I know heads are gonna roll for this. Hey, you took a bullet. Yeah, but I want you to know I take full responsibility for what happened to the professor. Plummer was the best security expert the Department of Defense ever had. He was working on a program to scramble launch codes that he called GHOST, Guided High Altitude Scrambling Transmitter. One pulse from a GHOST satellite, a country can't launch its own nukes. That's why the Serbians kidnapped him. GHOST is still out there, which is why I'm sending you back in. I need someone I can trust in this, and I know I can trust you. Okay. I'll put a team together. No. It's not that kind of mission. This is at the top of the Pentagon's priority list. Two days ago, I got a call from Admiral Blair. It seems that the professor's widow contacted him. Whoever killed her husband must think that Ghost is still in that house. Now, maybe it is, maybe it isn't. A safety deposit box has been discovered in Zurich in the plumber's name and I've been assigned to escort Mrs. Plummer there to retrieve the content. We're hoping it's the ghost program. In the meantime, someone needs to watch over those kids. That's where you come in. While you're there, you'll be looking for the hidden program as well. You must be Lieutenant Wolf. Admiral Blair said you'd be coming. Kid? Get your butts down here and say hello. Okay, you've already met Lulu. This is Zoe, Seth, and Peter. This is Lieutenant Wolf. He's the man who's gonna be staying with you while I'm away. Hi. Hi. Oh, this is Helga and Tyler. You have a pleasant family. Well, for the younger ones, I think it hasn't really sunk in yet. It's been hardest on Zoe and Seth. But they don't really like to talk about it. Anyway, about a week ago, someone broke into the house. No one was home. I didn't tell the kids, because I didn't want to scare them. Mrs. Plummer, I've dealt with- Oh! Oh my God! I'm sorry. That's Gary. He was Howard's. Gary, down. He bit me. Yeah, well, he thinks he's a guard dog. 인사를 마친 Shane은 집 안과 밖에 보안 장치를 설치합니다. 설치가 끝날 때쯤 엄마 줄리를 태우러 온 차가 집에 도착했고 줄리는 아이들을 셰인에게 맡기고 추리이로 떠납니다. Hey. Where's the baby? Is there anyone here that understands the meaning of the word discipline? Hey, Flipper, you don't like it, do something. I make bottle. Get off me. Oh my god. No, what are you doing? You spaz with my boyfriend. So you're the one that's been breaking in. Go back inside. No! Me chin get to kata hang sang shikoroko. Otoki jom heba. Ke pip taki rado. And your botanji. She song amnida. Totoki dara so so yo. We speak English, buddy. Yo, fool. Handle me like that again, and I'll be forced to lay knuckles upside your head. Okay, enough is enough. Come on, Scott, let's go. Come on. No, you don't. Get back here. Give me 20. I meant push-ups. So? Drop down, do 20. Okay, 
this is not the One. army or the navy. Real nice move, Lieutenant Smooth. Now he'll probably never speak to me. Then I did you a favor. Whoa, personal bubble invasion. Your mother was worried sick about you. You should call her and tell her the truth. Well, I'm sure you'll take care of that for me. Stay out of my life. Don't make a move till you're in the groove and do the Peter Panda dance. Just hop three times like a kangaroo. Side step twice, just like those crabs do. Three steps forward, one step back. What are you doing? You're burning daylight, move! It's Sunday. And it's 6 a.m. You're insane! Listen up. Your behavior is unacceptable. In order to maintain a state of safety, we need to maintain a state of order. Strong mind worker Excuse when they me. grow up. Excuse me! Now, I've only got one rule. Everything is done my way. No highway option. Do you copy? Do you copy? What? I said, do you copy? What? I said, do you copy? Do not copy me. Do not copy me. Hey, I mean it. Cut it out. Hey, I mean it. Cut it out. Everybody up. That means you too. <laughs> Tracking devices. Never take them off. The panic button is for emergencies only. Touch that, you'd better be dying. Or you're dead. I would rather chew off my arm than wear that. Just because my mom is paranoid doesn't mean that we have to take orders from you. Let me explain to you how the chain of command works. I tell you what to do. And you do it! End of chain. I'm not gonna have time to remember all of your names. You'll be Red Leader, Red Baby, Red One, Red... Where's the older male? There were five. He's in his room. Red Two! Red Two, open up! Red Two! What? I thought... Is this what you're trained to do? A shock and awe on my door? Hey, I can fix that with a hammer and some nails. It's really easy. No, it's not. Look it, it's broken in half. You can't fix that. If you'd been wearing this, this wouldn't have happened. What are you talking about? I was in the bathroom. You know I would never ask you for your help. But he has got to go. Okay, here he comes. Hey, you leave towel on the floor in the bathroom. I pick up after kids, not you. And light a match next time. <laughs> <laughs> Remain calm. I am calm. I quit. That makes me calm. Let's not be hasty about this. Hello? Hello? Don't even think about it. Lieutenant Wall? <laughs> Julie Plummer. Who's this? Julie Plummer. <laughs> Oh, Mrs. Plummer! Did something fall? What was that noise? Oh, no, 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 everything's okay. You'll be happy to know that I found the culprit that's been sneaking around your house. Great, who was it? Oh, just some teenager. A teenager? Okay. I wanted to tell you I'm gonna be a few more days. You're gonna be a few more days? Yeah, is that a problem? No, that's no problem. Just, that's fine, I'm just, I'm just doing my... Oh. Your what? Duty. And you're sure everything's okay? Oh, things are great, Mrs. Plummer. Yeah, you just do whatever you have to. Okay, well. Bye, Mrs. Mrs. Plummer! Just hey, let's calm down. Ah! 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 
She bit me. Catalina! I command you to come back here. That's a direct order. You can't leave a man behind. Red leader! I don't even know how to change a diaper. OK, everybody, listen up. There's been a change of plans. Your mother's not coming home as soon as she expected. So for now, we'll just have some more big fun. But tomorrow's a school day. I have wrestling practice. I need a signed release for driver's ed. I've got Firefly. I have to go to the mall. There's this new halter top on sale. I have, I have to, to stop her Whoa, OK, OK, halt. Halt. We'll take this hill one inch at a time. Only then can we rise to the challenge. Red baby. Okay, troops, breakfast. What are you waiting for? Dig in. I can cross my eyes. Want to see? No. <laughs> Tyler hates it when I do that. I know how he feels. What's he doing? Plumber residents. Yes, I know it's Monday today. No, Mrs. Plumber is away. Yes, we'll be right there. Who was that? Your vice principal. He said that if you and Seth are late again, you're both suspended. Yeah, I always said these kids needed a parole officer. I guess uh, Mrs. Plummer thought so too, huh? Well, you got a real uh, upper torso going on, huh? Looks like you have a pair of legs coming out of your shoulders. Holy mammoth. All right, you know what, Creeper? You just bought yourself an extra 15 minutes on the mats with the Myrninator. Excuse me, Lieutenant Shane Wolf. I'm watching the kids for the plumbers. A few days. I'm Myrny. Dwayne Myrny. My friends call me Little Puppet. I'm the VP here. I'm in charge of discipline, conduct, and truancy from top to bottom, K through 12. You're the vice principal and the wrestling coach. See the creeper over there? He has played hooky from every wrestling practice this month. And her, she has missed 22 driver's ed classes. Out of 23? These are the worst students in my school. I'm Your ashamed. School. Good morning, kids. <clears throat> Mr. Murney, thank you so much for watching my chair for me. I'll take it from here. I know. All right, then, kids, I think it's time to get back to class. I'll cut you some slack today, seeing as it's Lieutenant Wolf's first day. Thank you. So, you're the bodyguard. Well, Mrs. Plummer thought that the kids needed. She's already briefed me on everything, and she told me that the kids aren't fully aware of the situation, and that's the way she wants it. She also told me you're a team's guy. Yes, I am. Well, Petty Officer Third Class Claire Fletcher at your service. You're kidding. Four years at Naval Base Coronado, they paid for college. Honor, courage. Commitment. It's the way I run this school. I like that. So, permission to stick around and keep eyes on the kids? Permission granted. 교장 클레어의 허가를 받은 셰인은 타일러를 돌보며 학교 주변과 수업 받고 있는 아이들을 감시합니다. Boobs. <laughs> Lulu, can I see you in the family room? Who are those people? My troop, it's Monday. Monday, Wednesday, and Saturday are troop nights. All right, get rid of them. I can't. Everyone's parents go out on troop nights and they won't be back till eight. Mom's our den mother. You better tell your little friends <laughs> that they have to. <laughs> they were supposed to sell cookies. I don't do cookies. We have to. If we don't sell enough cookies, we can't go to the Jamboree. 
Cookies. Broke your cookies. Mm-hmm. Holy really baloney. Party's over. Oh my god, it's here. You're all gonna clean this house spotless. No highway option. Now get cleaning. Come on, Seth, you've been in there for an hour. Thanks a lot, Lieutenant Loser. Now I'm gonna be the school joke. I don't even know what I'm gonna say to my friends. You call those people your friends? Company downstairs, and that means you too. You're not my dad. In case you haven't noticed, this family is going through a really hard time, and you're just making everything a lot worse. You have no feelings. We hate you, and you hate us. So why don't you just leave us alone? Don't worry, when your mom comes back, I'm gone. Now what? Scott. Run! Take the babies! Go to your room! It's safe. Who was that? What did they want? What happened? Please don't leave us, Shane. What do they want? They were after the program that your father invented. So there really are people out there to get us. Yes, there are, Zoe. That's why I'm here. I think we're going to need a little more cooperation. From now on, you listen to me, and I'll listen to you, too. Deal? Relax. Relax. If you just relax. Relax. No. Relax. You've got to relax. Please, it, it's... Okay, so she wrecked the driver's ed car. The insurance will pay for it. They were parallel parking. The instructor jumped from the car. But it's not about her, it's about the boy. Has he been skipping class again? Skipping class? Yeah, he always skips sixth period, but this is. Uh, all right, Seth! Different. Okay, take off the hat. Look at that. That's how we showed up for practice today. And that's not all. I was doing a little recon in his locker, and I found this. OK? All right, now, if it was a girly magazine or, or a hamster, fine. Boys will be boys. But this is sick. This is not normal. We're very concerned. Seth, I don't understand unless you explain it to me. Why would you join the wrestling team if they hate it? I did it because my father wanted me to. Look, I know you're just trying to help, but don't. 
I can take care of myself. 다시 한번 이야기를 해보려고 세스의 방에 간 쉐이는 추적 장치를 풀고 창문을 통해 밖으로 나간 세스를 목격합니다. 아이들의 안전을 책임지고 있던 쉐이는 곧바로 조이에게 집을 맡기고 세스의 뒤를 쫓아갑니다. 
방과 후 시작된 셰인과 머니의 레슬링 대결 시작하자마자 머니는 공격적으로 달려들었지만 셰인에게 다 막히면서 반격당했고 셰인은 아주 손쉽게 이깁니다 레슬링 대결 이후 아이들과 더 가까워진 셰인은 룰루가 속해 있는 반딧불이 소녀단을 훈련시키고 막내 타일러를 능숙하게 케어했으며 조이의 운전 연습과 세스의 뮤지컬 연출을 도와주며 아이들에게 큰 힘이 되어줍니다 okay. When you're down and low, lower than the floor, and you feel like you ain't got a chance, boom, boom, boom. Don't make a move till you're in the groove and do the Peter Panda dance. Just hop three times like a kangaroo. Side step twice, just like the crabs do. Three steps forward, one step back. Quick like a turtle, lie on your back. Roll like a log till you can't roll no more. <laughs> Better jump quick like there ain't no floor. Hold your breath, jump to the left. And that's the Peter. I swear that's the Peter. That's the Peter Panda dance. <laughs> Good night, Peter Panda. Good night, Daddy. Hey, Skeever, what do you put in a jar and shake till they're dead? Fireflies? Go away, and he won't hurt you. <laughs> Customer service. Foot got stuck? Just stay still. Yes? Hey, it's Shane. I have excellent news. I think I found Ghost. Do you have it? No, it's in a steel vault. It needs some sort of two-prong key. I've been working on it all night, but it's tough. Great. Good work, Shane. We're on our way to the airport. Don't do anything further. I'll be there soon. The good news is, once I give this to my CO, whoever's been bothering you ain't gonna be bothering you anymore. Really? Really. What's wrong, Lulu? Your mother's coming home. You should be happy. But, Shane, doesn't that mean you have to go? You guys should go upstairs and get ready. Your mother will be home soon. I had a fight with Zoe before I left, so they probably trashed the place. Welcome home, Mom. Hi. I am so proud of you. I truly am. I am going to give you your choice of assignment. Anywhere you want to go, you just name it. <laughs> well, I appreciate that. But I have to think about it. You're going to have to think about it. Well, the military is all I've ever known. I have no regrets. I should hope not. It's just that being with this family, I've never had a family. Put so... your hands up! The chums? Give us the key. Put your hands up! He's not gonna be babysitting anymore. I trusted you. Howard trusted you. You've betrayed us, and you've betrayed this country. Guess what? North Korea pays better. Stethoscope, Mrs. Chung? No, but I've got some C4. I 
just had my eyebrows done. You little bug. Now, Peter. That's cute. Stuff doesn't hurt. Shane, you can't do this. You can't leave a man behind. Hold on, I got it. Shane. Oh, Shane. Where's mom? Mom. I'll find her. You guys run and get help. <coughs> Hurry. Are you sure you're gonna be okay? Yes, Lulu. Go. Get help. I'll go in there. They're heading for the car. Oh my god, what do we do? Find a car. I'll handle it. Bandit has struck again. I accept total responsibility. My intelligence, well, it just, it was faulty. If I had better resources. I told you not to pass her in driver's ed. You have exactly three seconds to get me through this minefield. One, two. Bill, she doesn't know. You're not taking another parent away from those kids. Now leave the family alone and I'll get you in. Zoe, Seth, Lulu, Peter, Tyler. You think this is a game? You can't make him do this. I know, Howard. You haven't got a chance. Chance. Don't make a move. Tim in the groove. Do the Peter Panda dance. Hop three times like a kangaroo. Sidestep twice. Step like the crap. Do three steps forward. One step back. Quick like a turtle. Lie on your back. Oh, like a long tail. You can't no more. Better jump quick like there ain't no floor! Hold your breath! Step to the left! That's a Peter Panda dance. Great work, Shane. I knew you'd figure it out. I think you better open it. No, 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 wait, 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 wait. Back away. You open it. Okay. 
She was never a good neighbor. Hey! Hey, hey! What are you doing to these kids? Hey! Hands where I can see them! Everybody! Put your weapons down! I want the ghost! <laughs> um, calm down. It's just a duck. Where's the ghost? I have it here. Bring it here. Put it on the ground. Okay, duck whisperer. Step away. Gary, now! <laughs> Let you have all the fun. So I guess you'll be taken off now, huh? Seeing as there's no reason to stick around anymore. I'm still here, aren't I? <laughs> yeah. What now? I don't know. Uh, I'm on dry land. Means you're the superior officer. True. So you tell me. <laughs> Lulu. Excuse me, ma'am. Could I have a few words with you, please? Sure. Well, we, I, you know. Oh. oh. I'll talk later. <laughs> Mission accomplished, soldier. I suppose it is. I guess you'll be leaving us now. I guess so. I want you to have this. Because I don't want you ever to forget me. I will never forget you. Because you're the best friend I ever had. No matter how far a long life takes me away, I will always be thinking about you. I love you, Shane. I love you, too. You are 16, going on 17. Baby, it's time to think. You are 16, going on 17. Fellows will Looks like you have a hit on your hands. You think so? Mm -hmm. Maybe you should take over the drama department instead of the wrestling team. <laughs> It's gonna be nice having you around now. Now that Mernie's found his true calling. It's gonna be my pleasure serving with you.